What is going on guys? Grave here. Welcome back to Call of Duty Black Ops 4. I wanted to bring you some news about Call of Duty Modern Warfare that the, that the devs did confirm on Twitter. Right now in Call of Duty Modern Warfare, you cannot loop your kill streaks. And what that means, in case you do not know, is just for an example, let's say you're running a UAV, a counter UAV, and some other type of kill streak, say a chopper, uh, just for example. Once you got all three of those streaks, you could go out and get more kills with your weapon, and you could get those streaks again, and just continuously get them over and over within one life if you did not die. You know, you just continuous to continuously get those streaks. Within Modern Warfare, once you have gotten your streaks, you cannot get them again in the same life. You have to die before you can get those streaks. So let's say you get your kill streaks right off the bat, start of the game, you're like 9-0, and you got your streaks, you call them in, and you go on a 20-gun uh, you know, streak after that. It will not matter. You will not get any more streaks until you die. So your streaks will reset on death. You only can use them once per life. So you cannot loop your streaks over and over. I'm not sure for the reason of this. The only thing I could think of was maybe to cut down on kill streak spam. There's a lot of players out there that don't play Call of Duty or don't like Call of Duty because of kill streaks. I'm sure these big game modes like 10 on 10, 20 on 20, and whatever else they're going to do later on with the 100 player mode. This will cut down a lot of spam and kill streaks in those modes because there would just be kill streaks everywhere. I'm sure in those uh, big game modes. I'm sure Battlefield players that are interested in playing Call of Duty with these bigger modes now would probably be a little more eager to play now that they know you cannot loot kill streaks. There won't be a lot of kill streak spam. But I feel in those bigger modes they should have just uh, disabled the large kill streaks and maybe just made more like support streaks like UAV and counter UAVs. I'm not quite sure how I feel about this. I'll have to wait and see how it plays out in the beta. But to me, running low kill streaks, things like UAVs, care packages, and all that stuff, and I know there's a lot of things in this game, kill streak wise, that are in the same tier. I think the uh, UAV and the care package are in the same tier, so you have to choose one or the other. You can't run both. But if you're going to run small streaks, I really don't see the point because you're going to get four, five, six kills and then you're just going to have to go die or go jump off the map or just get gun kills. I don't mind gun kills. I enjoy getting gun kills, but I know a lot of players out there enjoy doing the kill streak thing. So I kind of have mixed feelings about this. I think it will make players run larger streaks, which may slow the game down. And with no mini map, the game is already going to play slow as it is, especially at the start when people are trying to learn maps and and, and weapons and that kind of thing so with no mini map and a lot of players running bigger kill streaks because kill streaks don't loop i'm kind of wondering if it will make the game play too slow leave me a comment with your thought guys and of course if you like the video hit the like if you have not subscribed yet please do so and i'll catch you guys next time peace